Hello, this is BC Stifler here with another Transformers review. <clears throat> today's, uh, today I'll be reviewing my Transformers animated Snarl. He's one of the Dinobots. He is pretty neat. Um, he's pretty cool. He's a Triceratops. Nice Autobot emblem right there. His head right here can move, except it like separates from the rest, so it looks not realistic. Um, I like his color scheme. I don't have any of the G1 auto Dinobots, so I don't know if the color schemes are the same, but I think they are. His head's visible right here. Uh, his fists are right here, but you wouldn't really know that. <clears throat> so yeah, his parts are really well hidden. He comes with this little um, thing. Uh, looks supposed to be like a lava thing, like like that, if you feel like the outlines here. Like the bumps are supposed to be black, like lava ish. Like in Transformers Matrix video of this guy, he said it was like a Cheeto. <clears throat> yeah. This guy's mouth can open. Try to get it. There we go. So it can open all the way down, like to that point. Like, I mean, it can like fold all the way back, and then the nose can go down and stuff. This on camera. Oh, well, it's off. The nose can go, the nose can go down and stuff. <clears throat> Uh, the legs can go forward and back. The back legs can go back, and yeah, that's pretty much it. The tail can twist. Okay, now on the transformation. Okay, so to transform this guy, you want to take the Triceratops head here and just lift it up and fold it in like that and fold back the horns. I'm going to take this part here and fold it up and fold it, this part, here I'll figure it out later, I'm trying to, yeah. yeah I'll figure it out later. <clears throat> you want to take the, the legs here and fold these up straight like that, you go back a little bit, then you want to take this part here like the back and just pull them out and they'll just fold down Then you can take this here and, and not the, the legs and fold them down. Well, fold up the back legs first. Fold this down to right about there. It'll like stop, except you can keep on going, but you don't want to go. Clip them together and then fold them down. <coughs> Fix the side panels. Sometimes they'll move on you. You want to fold, pull it down the feet here. Uh, Then there's like little pegs on the side here, so you can peg in the this red part here, like pegs. Fold this down. Oh, there goes my more feature. I don't want to show you yet. Fold down the fist <coughs> of the front legs. These back legs here will keep on separating. Okay, now you want to take the front here and just fold it down. And there's like a little peg inside there. It'll just clip in. There, I think this is how it's supposed to look like that, or close to it. Yeah, I think that's how it's supposed to go. I'm not positive. And then you want to take <coughs> these parts here and just fold them out. There's some really nice detail behind the shoulder. I'm going to show you in a minute. Take the tail, twist it around, and then split it. Oh, ouch. Split it, and then fold it out. And if you want, you can take the club here. Open up his hand. And there's a peg right there. I want to put it, push it in there. Here, let me do it. I'm gonna push it in the peg, and it won't. And if you don't, unless you don't, unless you close the hand, it won't stay. And there you go. There is Chesper's animated snarl. I'm gonna show you the detail behind these shoulders. I hope you can see that. Yeah, look at all that. It's like a bunch of gears and stuff. 
It looks really, really awesome. You can't see like the whole thing, but if you could, if you had this guy, if you never look behind the shoulders, look behind the shoulders. It looks really cool. <coughs> There's like all the detail on it and stuff. Yeah, as you can see, I think I did something wrong with the chest here. Let me see if I fix it. No, I think that's how it's supposed to go, because that's as far up as it can go, unless I just... No, it won't let me do that either. Okay. <clears throat> this guy's really cool. I like this face. He is really awesome. Okay, now the one armor feature he has is there's little buttons back here. Um, press them. I think there's another way you can pop these things up, but I forget. Press the button here, and just press the other one, and flames pop up. I forget how to, how you get them. Oh, I think I know here, I'm going to try it. <clears throat> um, yeah, there goes the thing. I'm going to see if I can figure it out. I think I know how. Oh, I know now. Okay. Yeah, the other way you can do it is here. Let me pop back in the flames. If you take the arms and just fold them out, it'll like stop right there and just keep on pushing it. And the flames will pop out. And just fold up the arms. <coughs> yeah, the thing keeps on popping out. It's not that bad of a habit, though. I won't, won't do that on you all the time. I like the so it'll stand up better. So yeah, this is my review of Transformers Animated Snarl. Please rate, comment, subscribe. And if you haven't, <clears throat> please watch my clone custom base video. And then watch the uh, um, <clears throat> video with the exact same title set that has the word update after it. And please comment and answer my questions, please, if you could answer them. And for this is the third time I'm saying this in a different review. Um, the person who had the idea for the radar, there it is. If you want to see like what it does, just check the other two videos. All it does is just spin around and go up and down, different positions. Yeah, there's a quick overview of my base right there. So yeah, um, remember rate, comment, subscribe, and I will see you next time.